Hey guys, welcome back to Global Scout Channel. So after we saw we worked on the Camaro, we got it ready. Today we got ourselves a new build. So I'm just gonna get ready to go pick up the trailer for the truck and then head to Copart. Let's go. After I got to Copart, I found that the policy has been changed, so you cannot pay with the money orders anymore. So I went to the website and they checked again for the new way to make the payment. I found out that you can pay with MoneyGram, Western Union, Upper Pay, credit cards and debit cards. Good things, I got my credit card with me. I'm gonna go to the office, submit the payment and go pick up the car. After you submit the payment, we go to the Copart transportation app to schedule a pickup time and then you just wait for your time when it's ready you just receive the message and then go pick up the car all right guys officially we got the title we are the owner of the car let's go <music> Okay, the first damage that you can see it's only on the fender pushed in but from the door panels it's still good which is a good sign and look at it the windshield wiper is still there which is a good sign that nothing is broken there is no leak that you can see the front bumper it's cracked so most likely it has to be replaced or I might try to get it fixed not sure yet the other side is similar it looks the same problems Okay, so let me just open this side and then see the interior. See if we're gonna have any, any surprise, guys. Are you guys excited? I am, so let's see the interior. All right, the first thing I feel that the door is rubbing with the front fender. I think because of the impact of the accident, it was pushed in. That's why I wasn't able to open it all the way up. And then the steering wheel airbags need to be replaced. The key is here, which is good because many times even if you see them on the copart website when you try to buy these cars it might show the keys but when you go pick them up in person it's not there anymore and then the uh, even if you ask the office they will be yeah that's what it is so the interior looks clean very basic for the 2020 toyota yaris those cars known for this but the engine is the best in the market those engines can last over 300,000 miles like nothing so this is a 2020 toyota yaris and the price we got it, it was unreal. This is how it was listed on the Copart website. I don't see a big damages from the in, from the outside. The only concern that I had, maybe it might has the inner carriage, which is it was not listed on the website. The interior looks clean. I don't see no rips on the seats, no tears. Everything looks good. 
the plastic it's there nothing is broken the steering wheel airbags looks like it needs to be replaced i can see the keys and then i think at that time it was on so i was able to zoom in to see if there is any error message on the dashboard i want to get a heads up of what other problems might the car have by just looking on the dashboard so that's like a good tip for you guys if you're buying cars online from auctions and you never see it in person that it might help you to find out on you don't have to get some other surprises so after looking at the car i want you guys to leave me on the comment section below how much we got this price or if you are the winning or the bidder for this car how much would you get for this car so let me get ready i'm gonna start this car and get ready to go home other problems is it? Alright guys, I think it's gonna be the wrap for today. I'm gonna make a list for all the parts we need and you're gonna see all of that on the next video. Stay tuned.